Can we please have quiet on the set? It's Maroon 5 with memories on Love 107.1. Frans and Lorna on your breakfast show. And we're back with Mr. Mo'in Al-Bastaki, a uh, magician, mentalist, and illusionist. Thank you so much for being with us. Thank you very much. And we're going to see something now, yes. some magic or some mentalism. Yeah, um, we're going to leave it completely <laughs> up to you. You need definitely. to guide us so, now. What's so, going to happen? So what happened, my grandfather, he's normal with us. Um, Allah yarham. Allah yarham. So he had a box in his room. I was always wanting to go and see what's inside that box. And he was always, no, you can't go and see inside that box. I said, no, I want to go and see inside that box. I was a small kid until he passed away. And inside that box was this watch, this pocket watch. I want you to hold, Lorna, this pocket watch. Yes. Oh, gosh, the pressure. It's been, it's the been, pressure. It's been sanitized. Don't drop it, Lorna. <laughs> Don't drop it. I would like you to think of a time. I want you to think of a time. Think of... Just give any me, time? Any time. Give me an hour. You can change your mind as many times as you want. So, so not a time in my life. Think of a time on the clock. A time on the clock. Okay. okay please, you can tell me. Okay, so 8 p.m. 8. Yeah. Minutes. Uh, 13. 13. 8, 13. Mm -hmm. A time that Lorna picked. You could keep that uh, watch aside. I'm not coming okay. back here at 8.13. <laughs> <laughs> you decided on a time. Yeah. Open that watch. No. The open watch it, was in front of Lorna this there. entire time, by the way. It wasn't no, in just, front. Just click. Just push oh, it on just the push top. push it? What time is it? It's not 8.13. It, it is. Show me. It's 8.13. Oh, my God. It's 8.13. That, that clock was in front of you the entire time. Yeah. How is that even possible? That's insane. That... I literally... <laughs> I took the watch off you and put it down straight in front of me. You didn't go anywhere near this. We have... Uh, we so have weird. we have two or three cameramen in the studio. Did you see anything? No, <laughs> didn't see anything. Oh my goodness! I'm All actually right, shaking a little bit. Let's let's take the dice. Let's take the dice. Okay. Yes. I wanted to change the number. I wanted to pick one, and decide on the one on top. Okay. Do you have one? Once you have yeah. one, you can tell me. You tell me once you're ready. Yes. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready. You have a number. Yeah. Yes. So there is no way that anybody would know. No. The tension is killing me. Number five, isn't it? Yes! Okay, oh my god. It's you know number what? five! <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's, what? let's try this one more time. Let's try this one more time. <laughs> this is really freaking me out. Okay, so doing it again. <laughs> All right, okay. You have a number? Yeah. Okay. I want to try and send that number to me. From your head mm -hmm. to my head. Did you, did you look at the number? Yeah, I looked it at it. Number six. Yes, it's yes, number okay. six. Number six. You know what? You got it. What this time, is going on? this time, I don't even want you to look at the number. Oh. This <laughs> makes this more than impossible. I oh, want you to change, gosh. and this time you don't look at the number. So okay. there's no way okay. that I would know, or anybody would know what the mm -hmm. number is. Mm -hmm. You're holding it. There's no way that I would know. Mm -hmm. I'm shaking a bit. <laughs> so there is no way that you know. No, I don't even know what There's the number no is. No way that I know. No. And nobody else does know. No. You know what? I'm just gonna go with this. Putting my repetition on the line. Yeah. You pick the number. I don't know. Maybe number one. Please check. Oh my god. Is it number, it's one? number one? It's number one. Thank you very much. Oh my Thank god. Thank you very much. <laughs> We're I gonna, need to go and lie down. We're going to have some more magic in a bit, but right now it's Little Mix on Love 107.1. Fast and Lorna, on your breakfast show, having our minds sufficiently blown. Is your mind blown? Yes. <laughs> My mind is blown. We have Mr. Mu'in Al-Bastaki, a UAE-based magician, a mentalist, and illusionist, and uh, he just did a trick on Lorna, which... Uh, well, it wasn't really a trick. He just, like... He just read, read your mind. But he, you didn't even read my mind, though, because I didn't know what number I had for the final bit of the, you know, the, the dice. I didn't even look at the dice. And now it's my turn. It's your turn. So, um, uh, Faris, um, you would have a bank card, yes? Sure. So, the 
I don't think Lorna knows the, knows the password. She does not. So uh, <laughs> you you might share the password of your bank card, maybe to the loved one or somebody that you really, really, really trust. Yeah. So let's try this. Let's try this. Imagine me and you are walking in Mall of Emirates. Okay. Yes. And walking, enjoying the view, going uh, window shopping and all that. And Excuse then. Dubai. Excuse Dubai. Okay, <laughs> bye. So you go like listen, mine. If you could guess my. ATM password. I don't like the, where this is going. I don't. <clears throat> yeah. Your lunch is on me today. So I go, okay, you know what? Let's just go to everything's uh, on me ATM, today. <laughs> ATM machine. Can you show me your palm, please? Just show me your palm. Okay, fine. You can put it down. Thank you. So imagine me and you are standing in front of an ATM machine. Which bank is this from? This is Emirates Islamic Bank. Yeah, okay. A fine bank. Other banks are available. Here we go. Good PR for them. Isn't it? <laughs> So imagine we are standing there. You put the card in. I'm holding your hand, and uh, after sanitizing our hands, of yes, course, of definitely. Course. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I am trying to guess what would your ATM password be. Look at me. Imagine you're sending the first number from your head to my head. Imagine there's a thread connecting your head to my head. The first number. Now tell me where I should stop on revealing your number. Okay. But then I'm going to just go through the numbers. Now, you're a kind of person that, very friendly, uh, but you would find difficulty to make really solid, trustworthy friends. It's going to take you time to trust somebody and then make a friend, yes? Sure. And that, that gives me a signal that your password would not be a simple 0000. zero, zero, zero. It's going to be something different. It's going to be a little bit up and down, different numbers, yes? Yeah. Yes, thank you. So the first number, first number. The first number, think of a first number. Okay. Four, isn't it? It is. Okay. <laughs> I don't like, don't like where this is going. <laughs> don't like it. Second number. I want you to think of the second number in a different language than you thought of the first number. Okay. Can I do that? Yeah, thank you. Second number. Um, two. Oh, I'm going to have to stop you there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to... I mean, I'm going to stop you there. I, 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 think, I think you just need to change the pin. Do, do, you yeah. want me, do you want me to reveal the third or the fourth one? I don't want you to reveal any of them. I'm going to whisper the, re the remaining numbers in your ear if you would want me okay. to, yes? Right. And then you give the reaction and the audience would know that. Uh, you need some water? I'm, I'm, putting, I'm putting my mask on. <laughs> He's actually visibly sweating. All right. I cannot believe you're about to reveal uh, the, He's gonna the, the, it. the pin right. of the car. <laughs> okay. I'll just keep talking so that nobody hears it, but we do know that the first two number on uh, Faris's uh, for Faris's pin is four two. He just uh, whispered the rest. Really? Yeah. You better hide your card, it Faris. Is, it is. <laughs> it is. He doesn't. No. No. I don't need to hide my card. You know why? Because if he knows, if he knows the pin, probably knows the the account number. <laughs> probably knows the number on the card. And he probably knows the security, the security number on the back. So he can just go on Amazon and have a field day. Okay, we're going to be back with Moen in just a second. We are talking to Mr. Moen Al Bastakif. We're going to do a little bit more magic. What do you have for us now? So I brought with me some dried corn. Lorna, mm -hmm. if you would don't mind. It's enough for a handful. Can, if you can pick one. Just pick one, just one corn. Just one. Okay. If my pin number's in there, I'm going to be so angry. <laughs> there you, <go. laughs> so you can put the rest there. Okay. I want you to take that. Yeah. Put it on my tongue. Put it on your tongue. Yeah. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. Yeah. It's, I can confirm that the corn is in his tongue. <laughs> oh, gosh. If you cook it inside your face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Put your finger here, please. Can, can you feel something? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what's going on? He's not going to pull it out oh, of his no, eye. Oh, no, what is happening? He's pulling something out of his eye. If it's a cooked popcorn. Uh, oh, what's going on? Oh, no. I currently have my hand. Oh, my oh, God. Oh he my just God. pulled a corn out of his eye. So the corn I put in your mouth has just popped out of your right eye. Uh, by the way, if you're currently driving and wondering what is going on, we are videoing all of this. I'm. You're holding a corn that's been in a man's eye. I'm. Sanitize your hands. What is going on? <laughs> what on earth? What do you What do you eat it? No. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
put it in your pocket. It's good for luck. Put okay. it in my pocket? Yeah. yeah. Please don't. Please. <laughs> you got, you've got his icon. Do you just see how I'm just doing everything he's telling me to do? This is really terrifying. Maybe I should learn some magic. <laughs> this is why I'm not good around magicians and illusionists, because I, I just get far too carried away. I should learn some magic. Be like, Lorna, now I need you to be quiet. <laughs> And then just leave it like that for the next four hours. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, I am sufficiently, uh, first of all, impressed. Second yeah. of all, grossed out. And third of all, quite anxious. So I am absolutely blown away. I would, do you know what? I would love you on the show every day. I love stuff like this. I absolutely <laughs> love it. If people want to see more of what you do, where, sure. where can they find you? Uh, at Moin al on all social media, mm -hmm. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, everywhere. And my website, www.moyenelbesteki.com. Yes, that's so, spelled M-O-I-E-N. Or uh, M-O-E-I-N-A-L-B-A-S-T-A-K-I. -E 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 that's right. And you've brought something in, something that uh, would be very useful to any kids listening right now who might be interested in ma Definitely. magic. Definitely. Um, from 2015, I decided that I want to give back to the community. I want to do something. So I've brought two for Lorna and Faris. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, and wow. Look at this. We've got our very own magic kits. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, wow. Thank you very much. This so, is unbelievable. Um, this is available everywhere. I mean, uh, Kidzania, IMG, um, everywhere. Noon, Amazon, whatever you guys want to have. So uh, hopefully Faris is going to learn some magic and perform for you guys. <laughs> hopefully. In the coming days and future. I'm just going to warn you, next time you come back, Moen, I am going to be pulling uh, a chicken... Shawarma out of my left ear. You're so hungry. You're so hungry. <laughs> <laughs> if you could do that now, I'm pretty hungry. You're pretty hungry. Mr. Mo'ayan al thank you so thank much you for joining us. Thank you for the time. Thank you.